Hello everyone, Senyes here. Into this video, I'll tell you about the text feature in Procreate. Procreate has a not very obvious feature of adding the text. You can find this option if you go to Actions, Add, Add Text. After doing that, you'll get a bounding box with the word text in it. If you need to move your text, drag the active bounding box around the canvas. If you want to align, select, cut, copy, paste or select the font style, double tap on your text to invoke the text entry companion. Also here you can find and use the keyboard to type what you want. The text will appear in your current color and in default font. If you'd like, you can also use your Apple Pencil to scribble the text. To further adjust your text font, style, design and attributes, tap the font name in the text entry companion. This will invoke the Edit Style panel. Now, when we know the basics, let's take a closer look at the Edit Style panel. The Edit Style panel gives you control over font, style, design and attributes. Under Font, you can select the typeface for your text. Scroll through the font list and browse all your installed typefaces. The name of each font is a preview of the appearance of that font. Procreate has pre-installed iOS system fonts and Procreate fonts. And if it's not enough, you can import fonts through Procreate's interface. You can also use AirDrop, the Files app, drag and drop or bulk import your favorite fonts. Under Style, you can find different versions of one font. Fonts frequently include regular, italic and bold versions. Some include other options like ultralight, thin and black. Under the Design section, you can change size, kerning, tracking and other font attributes with slider-based design tools. The Design section offers six sliders to tweak the following font design attributes. Under Attributes, you can change the alignment of your text, add underlines, outlines or toggle capitals. There is a series of buttons and toggles that control various alignment and text effects. Now let's talk about the text formats. By default, the text in Procreate appears in vector format. That means it stays crisp while scaling it and also stays editable. While it's vector, you can type a new content, change a font, spacing, style, alignment, add the underline, outline and capitalization effects. You can use uniform transformation, clipping masks, change opacity, group the text with other objects. In the Layers panel, you can identify vector text by the A letter visible in the text layer thumbnail. The layer name will also automatically change to reflect its text content. But you can also rasterize it to make it a pixel-based image. That means that you will be able to work with the text as if it's just a picture. To rasterize your text, tap the text layer in the Layers panel. This invokes the Layer Options menu where you can tap Rasterize. You won't be able to retype the text, but for example, you will be able to use any transformation or adjustment. And that's it for the text option. Hope this tutorial was helpful and if you still have any questions, write them down in the comment section down below. And if you want to learn more about Procreate, just click on the next video right here. See ya!